A multi-billion dollar scheme to encourage domestic tourism has been approved. Every citizen will be eligible for travel subsidies worth thousands of Taiwan dollars, which can be used between July and October. The subsidies aim to help Taiwan's flagging tourism industry recover from the ravages of the coronavirus epidemic. Whether it's screaming with glee at an amusement park or breathing in the fresh air of a forest, everyone likes a holiday. Now a new subsidy scheme will let everyone in Taiwan take a break on the government's dime. Initial plans indicate the scheme will subsidize independent travelers by 1,000 NT for every hotel room they occupy. Alternatively, if you travel with a tour group, each person will get 700 NT off their bill each day. That will go up to 1,200 NT for a trip to Taiwan's outlying islands. The scheme will run from July 1st to the end of October, and it can be used any day of the week. It's great. Most discounts are only for weekdays. Working-age people like me are going to work every day, but my old folks don't get out of the house, so I'll take them on holiday. After the epidemic, everyone will be going out. Oh, you can use a subsidy on weekdays too? Huh, well, that's good. I think about taking a trip during the week. The triple stimulus vouchers aimed at economic revival are coming out soon too. If you combine them with a travel subsidy, you could spend a night in a hotel room that would normally cost 3,000 to 4,000 NT and just spend a few hundred dollars or even nothing at all. For those who like tours, Lion Travel is offering its own discount worth 3,000 NT. Life Travel and Tour Service has special themed packages. All the travel agencies have got the news about the scheme and now we need to reappraise our resources. Our company will soon announce a new promotion along the lines of spend your 3,000 NT triple stimulus vouchers with us and we'll give you an extra 5,000 NT worth of services. Originally, the scheme's budget was 2 billion NT. Now that's grown to 3.9 billion NT. Premier Su Zhenchang says that could go up even more, indicating it could be the largest domestic travel boost in Taiwan's history. By putting no restrictions on the dates of its usage, officials are clearly hoping to entice as many people as possible to take the offer up.